So basically, when the seller even gives the same property to three agents, what happens? Agents want to get leads, so they go and they list the property on portals. And let's say the seller wants one million for the property, but this agent want all buyers search to end up with him. So what he does, he will list his property for nine 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 nine. Because when the property search low to high, he will appear first. And then this agent sees that this guy is putting triple nine triple nine, and then he put triple nine 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 eight, and then this guy would go and put nine fifty, and he would say, "I just want to get the buyer. When I get the buyer, then I'll deal with the seller and I'll negotiate the price." So it's really essential for sellers to do their due diligence very very well and identify the best agent and the best agency to promote their property and to sign exclusively with them based on certain KPIs. So. Don't give your property to everyone thinking that when you give it to everyone, you're gonna, your chances to sell it are going to be higher. Trust me, when it's with the right agent and that agent has good um, network in the market, every other agent will come to him and he will close with him when the property is priced well, when the property is well maintained and when it's given to a professional agent.